Good morning, skincare obsessed people. My name is Sanne Vloed. You might know me from YouTube or from uh, magazines or Runway. I, safe to say, have spent more than eight years in the fashion industry and in like the beauty industry. And, you know, I've had endless times I was sitting in the chair and asking uh, beauty experts and makeup artists, like, what to use for my skin, how to get this glowy skin. And I'm actually very excited because today I'm going to go to Dermalogica's HQ and we're really diving deep into all the skincare myth. So what is actually working for our skin? What is actually giving us that glowy look and what kind of products do we really need to use? Thank you. Okay, we arrived at the Therma Logica HQ. Um, I'm excited to diving deep into skincare myths today. Dermalogica actually got its start as an educational institution back in 1983. It was called the International Dermal Institute and it provided education to the professional skincare industry. Fast forward today. Dermalogica trains over 100,000 skin therapists a year in over 90 countries. They are an education company at their roots that has evolved into now selling great products. So here we are. Good morning. Good morning, welcome. Hello. How are you? <laughs> Good. Uh, my name is Lizzie. I'm Sana, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, Sana. I think today we're going to discuss some big hydration skincare myths. Yes! So I am here to help you debunk those myths. Um, a little background about myself is that I'm our national training manager with Dermalogica and I help train product knowledge um, with Sephora and we're both passionate about education and making sure that we achieve those maximum results in our skin. Um, so I thought it'd be kind of fun to talk about these myths but also get our hands a little dirty and play with the products so that we can really experience the difference that these products make in our skin and debunk some of those myths at Amazing. the same time. I would say I'm passionate about learning, so all right, let's, let's do it. All right, cool, come on over. Well, the first one is drinking lots of water will keep your skin hydrated. Oh, I'm curious about this. Okay, this is a good one because I get it all the time, especially from our students of, how yeah. can my skin still be dehydrated? I drank a gallon of water today. What's going on? <laughs> so when we drink water, it goes to our organs, mm -hmm. it goes to our muscles, and unfortunately, the last place to get it is our skin. Oh, okay, I didn't know that. So. <laughs> so when we're thinking about drinking water, yes, drinking water is important, but it's not enough by itself. We need to make sure that we're using products to topically keep that hydration in our skin first, since the skin is the last place to receive that moisture. What we're gonna try is thinking about starting your skincare regimen off correctly with the proper cleanse. Because if you're using a cleanser that's very stripping and drying to the skin, sometimes it's called the, the squeaky clean effect, right? Um, this is actually not good for the skin. That means you're stripping all of that hydration off and it's causing more dehydration in the skin. So with Dermalogica, we teach the double cleanse. And with that double cleanse, what it does is it removes those impurities, but without stripping or drying or irritating the skin. Okay. Well, I'm excited to try it, out. Try it out. Yeah, okay, for sure. <laughs> um, so let's go ahead and get you prepped and ready. Okay. So with our Dermalogica Double Cleanse, we're gonna start with pre-cleanse. And mm -hmm. this is a cleansing oil. So we're gonna go ahead and apply this onto dry okay. skin. So I'm gonna put a pump or two into your hand here. There we go. And we're gonna go ahead and apply this onto dry skin. And the reason behind using it on dry skin is that these oils, right, we have kukui nut, barrage seed, apricot kernel oils, are going to grab onto any makeup, dirt, oil, and debris. But remember, we're not drying or stripping the skin, so it's gonna maintain those barrier lipids that we really need to keep the skin hydrated, but remove that debris. And then you're gonna go ahead and rinse that completely off. And then we're gonna immediately go into our second cleanse. So I noticed you're almost done there rinsing that off. Yeah. I'm gonna put a little bit of our special cleansing gel. And what's beautiful about special cleansing gel is you can feel that it has this nice foamy lather. It really cleanses the skin, but it is a soap-free cleanser. So it's not going to strip or dry out the skin. Your skin's just gonna feel really kind of fresh afterwards. And we'll go ahead and rinse that off there. And you've okay. just completed your Dermalogica double cleanse. 
Yeah, and you're right. I do not feel like I used a very like aggressive type of cleanser. My skin just feels. Your skin of... looks amazing. Yeah. Wow. yeah. Very fresh. <laughs> <laughs> Exfoliating daily can cause your skin to become dehydrated. Mm, I hear this one. Yes. I've heard this a lot. A lot of people are scared of exfoliation or they're nervous about it because they feel like it can overprocess or dehydrate the skin. So making sure that you're using the right exfoliant for the skin is really key, especially for daily exfoliation. So the product that we recommend um, is Daily Microfoliant. And why we like this one and why it's safe to exfoliate daily with is that it uses enzymes as the exfoliant. So enzymes are a type of exfoliant that dissolve or um, digest dead skin cells so that once those dead skin cells are gone, they become inactive, which is why it's safe to use daily because it's not going to over process or over exfoliate the skin. Okay. Well, let's try it out. <laughs> let's try it. We're going to add a little bit of powder, about a half a teaspoon of powder, and we're going to add some water to that. And we're gonna foam it up so it should look and feel like a cleanser. Oh, you got yeah. a beautiful lather there, show everybody. Good, I got a good foamy one. <laughs> show everybody that lather, that's beautiful. And we're gonna go ahead and massage that around. And what's happening as we're doing this is that this is removing those dead surface cells that can actually cause more dehydration in the skin. So those dead surface cells are preventing those wonderful serums and moisturizers from penetrating deeper into the skin. So exfoliation really is important for dehydration because if we don't remove those dead surface cells, mm -hmm. then your serums and your moisturizers um, are gonna have a harder time going in to hydrate the skin. Mm -hmm. To really like penetrate in. Exactly. It feels really soft. I have an extremely like sensitive skin. Um, it almost feels like a foamy yeah, like a, cleanser. a, like a yeah. foamy cleanser. Yeah, because this is not a scrub. This is meant to dissolve with the enzymes, this, those dead skin cells. It feels very, very clean. And so do you like feel hydrated. a difference starting off on the right foot with cleansing properly that now your skin's not feeling as dry or dehydrated as you yeah. sometimes feel? If you, that's how you really notice if you have, I feel like a wrong cleanser where just your face feels very like tight and you want to immediately add something else on it. Yeah. Absolutely. So now before we are done here, um, we're going to finish with some hydration products because I don't know if you know this, but you have 60 seconds or less to put hydration on after you exfoliate your skin. Okay. Well, <laughs> so let's we're run done. over and we're going to put some hydration on, but I'm going to bring good. you into my treatment room. Okay? okay. Let's do it. Perfect. We're going to finish this treatment with our serums and our moisturizers. And I wanted to show you our new product. It's our Circular Hydration Serum. You can find this at Sephora. And what's cool about this product is that it's going to help you get hydration instantly, but also over time and helping renew that hydration from within your skin. What we have in here that I really want to focus on today is that it has hyaluronic acid in there. It also has this algae infused moisturizing matrix, and then it has this polyglomatic acid Acid, which are going to really deliver that hydration deep into your skin. Ooh, I'm excited to try it. Um, <laughs> and I actually heard you saying hyaluronic acid serum. I did. <laughs> and this is what our next myth is about. Oh, really? Okay. Hyaluronic acid dehydrates the skin. So hyaluronic acid is a humectant. It binds a thousand times its own weight in water. So what that means is that Hyaluronic acid is going to try to grab water from the environment, from our skin, anywhere to hold on to that moisture. So if we're using hyaluronic acid in a very dry environment or our skin is dry, then what can happen is it's trying to find that hydration and hold on to it. Um, so we need to make sure that we're using this the correct way. So basically hyaluronic acid serum by itself doesn't do as much as when you combine it with moisture and it's more hydrated. Yes, other layers of hydration. That makes total sense because we had a conversation this morning before and I was like, I have this new technique where I completely wet my face and I apply my serums and my skin has been less dry because of this reason. 
because you're applying hyaluronic acid to that damp skin. That makes sense because it needs that moisture yeah. to hold on to that moisture and keep that moisture in the skin. So with that concept, let's change it just a little bit. So instead of just using mm. water on the skin to dampen it, what I'm gonna recommend is we're gonna do a toner. And our toners are meant to hydrate the skin, make them more porous, and they're mm. pH balanced to the skin. Because water is not pH balanced, it can actually yeah. dehydrate the skin. So a toner is going to hydrate the skin balance the pH so that when we go to use our serum on top, that hyaluronic acid, now we're adding layers of hydration to bind that moisture to the skin. Okay. So I'm going to mm -hmm. go ahead and apply some of these products to your skin so you can feel those layers of hydration as we apply them on. Perfect. So you notice I sprayed it on the skin and I'm not going to wait for it to dry. I'm going to go ahead and apply that serum right on top. So with my circular hydration serum, I'm going to do about a dropper full into my hands and we're going to go ahead and massage this into your skin. How's this feeling? It feels really good. It feels like the skin is immediately like absorbing the serum. Is this a moment where you add the eye cream in as well? Absolutely. So during the step um, after toner, you would do your serums mm -hmm. and your eye treatment. So thank you for asking about that because it's important to deliver hydration in the eye area. We know that the eyes are one of the first places mm -hmm. to show dehydration in the skin. What other things do you notice around your eye area? Um, well, if I feel dehydrated, it's like <laughs> darkness, puffiness, and definitely the first place to see where I look tired or it not. It is, right? You can always tell with somebody's mm -hmm. eyes. And I love that you said the dehydration as well as the puffiness, because I'm going to put on you today our new Awaken uh, Peptide Eye Gel. Um, this product here is great for the morning time. And it's a hydrating gel that is going to help with puffiness hydration and fine lines and wrinkles around the eye. So what I'm gonna do is just apply this right underneath the eye here, and then I'm gonna go right above the orbital bone. How's this feeling? Very relaxing. <laughs> Don't fall asleep on me now. <laughs> so lastly, we want to make sure we're adding layers of hydration. So we did our toner, we did our hyaluronic acid hydrating serum, right? The circular hydration serum. And we wanna make sure the last step of our treatment is our moisturizer because our moisturizers seal everything in. So we're going to use Dynamic Skin Recovery. This is a daytime moisturizer that has an SPF 50 in there. Are you using sunscreen every day? I do, okay. yeah. <laughs> okay, so I don't have to talk to you about making sure you're using your sunscreen every day. Um, so this one is going to hydrate your skin again with some hyaluronic acid in there and it has that SPF 50 that is going to protect you in the daytime. So we are done with your treatment today. How is your skin feeling? Oh, thank you so much. It feels really good. It feels very hydrated, very moisturized, very soft. I definitely learned how just drinking enough water is not enough to hydrate your skin, but really the combination and techniques on how to use the products to really improve that hydration. Thank you so much for coming today and we are all done. Perfect, thank you so much. And we are all done for today. That was so much fun to learn more about skincare and to really dive deeper into the science of skincare. And Lizzie was really great in like explaining everything. So if you want to check out the Dermalogica products, you can um, find them at your local Sephora store. And yeah, I hope this video was helpful. I know, hope this is going to give all of us some extra inspiration. I will see you guys soon. Bye-bye.